What up, YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. It's your boy, Bizmatic. And I'm back with another one for y'all, man. Um, This time around, actually, y'all already know, this is still part of the Fine Line album review playlist. This is my last review on the Fine Line album by Harry Styles. Um, I already said goodbye in the last one, so I ain't gonna say goodbye again. Now, I had told y'all I was gonna rank all the tracks from my least favorite to my favorite and i'm sure y'all want to know my favorite but just because over here i want to have fun i want to keep this unpredictable and fun right now right now if you're watching and you have been watching right i already know some of y'all very favorites but i'm challenging you to do your top 12 all right before i even start mine this is the perfect time to pause the video and write in the comment section below your top 12 12 being your least favorite. We're going to start from 12 to 1. That's how we're going to do it. We're going to go backwards. 12 to 1. 12 being your least favorite and 1 being your favorite. Now, that doesn't mean these tracks or any of these tracks are bad. It's just, you know, in the order that you're feeling. Just how you feeling right now. I know with me, I rearrange, like, my favorite songs on albums so many times. It's crazy. Like, my least favorite become my favorite. Like, you feel me? That's how it goes when you really like appreciate an album. So I'm challenging y'all to do that right now. Pause the video and write yours. And then at the end of the video, we could see how, how they match together. If y'all thinking like me today, if y'all feeling like me today. <laughs> All right. Um, just before I get to the list, this album, honestly, I have been listening to it every day, every, every day. Yo. I just love this album. There's so much personality to this album and it takes you so many places. It's very vulnerable at times. Other times it's super happy. Other times it's it's just weird. I'm just like, what the fuck is going on? But all of that make it dope and sonically, it's, it's just so pleasing to the ears and, and I just love it. I even love the artwork. At first I was like, what the fuck is this shit? And now the more you listen to the album, it's like, yo, I present to you something different. You feel me when you see the cover? So yeah, yo, Harry Styles, I've gained a lot of respect for Harry Styles through this experience and through seeing him marching and shit um, for, for the whole George Floyd cause or just Black Lives period, which is dope because out of the group, I would say this, and I just figured this out. Zayn was a part of One Direction. I did not know that. Black people fucking love Zayn. Like, I don't hear no black person talking about Harry Styles, but black people love Zayn. You feel me? He does a lot of covers of black music, and he's done songs with... I feel like Zayn fit, like, threw himself in the R&B realm, and, and, and we just accepted him. Like, niggas love Zayn. You feel me? So... I think next I might check out his albums if he does have any albums. But I've heard Zane a lot, but I'm not sure if he has any albums. So I did not know he was part of One Direction. That's fucking crazy. Yo, that group is a talented ass group. It's crazy. And if I'm wrong about that, y'all let me know. But I'm pretty sure he's, he was part of One Direction. I discovered that the other day. Yeah, anyways, without further ado... What you came here for. Do, 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 do. But now, nah, if you're new here, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. We talk everything music here. And also, if this is the first video you're finding out about this series, link in the comment section. You know what's crazy? I kept saying that, but the last two videos, I actually didn't comment the link. It's because I got so many other videos right and people are commenting you feel me and i get a lot of like hate comments and all that too you feel me? i get hate comments yeah can you believe it yeah i do but yeah so let's do this let's do this let's do this i'm gonna try to make this fast and i'm not gonna break down why for each song because y'all have the playlist y'all already seen me um review these songs so you'll get an idea why this list is the way it is but i will say this though Number 12 is Fine Line. And I said I would say this because Fine Line is the one I listen to the least <laughs> on this album, right? And it's, it's a great song, but 
the first half of the album, I listen to over and over again. You know, as I as I do the reviews or whatever, I go back and I listen. And then it got to a point where I was listening to up to, like, the second to last song. I was listening to the album up to that over and over until I got the rest done for y'all, right? So I had the least time with Falling. So I'm just going to, I'm just going to, I mean, Fine Line. So I'm just going to put it right here, okay? Number 12 is Fine Line. Number 11, which was tough for me to do. It was between this and another one. Ah, number 11 is Sunflower Volume 6. Sunflower. <laughs> I like that song, right? But it was between that and number 10, which is Treat People With Kindness. Treat People With Kindness was, was just, a, for me, it was just a, a happy song. And, and I liked it. it. I liked the vibe of it. It made me feel good. So I'm like, yeah. You know what's crazy? Even Sunflower is kind of like a, a feel-good song, too, I would say. So, quick recap. Number 12, Fine Line. Number 11, Sunflower Volume 6. Number 10, Treat People With Kindness. Number 9. Number 9. Number 9 is To Be So Lonely. Yes, to be so lonely. I love that song. Love, 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 love it, love it. Number eight, Kenyan Moon. Okay, now, this song grew on me, right? It grew on me. Honestly, if I haven't listened to this song as many times as I did, it would have probably been number 11 or something, but it just grew on me. It just, I don't know, it just grew on me. It's, it, it's like going back to that happy place. It, 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 and it's just like, that. this one was beautifully written. It was It was just like, it was just well put together. I love this song. Number seven, Golden, which is the intro track. In my head, I thought Golden was going to be higher on the list. Until I started listening, listening, listening. I'm like, dang, this is a great song. This song is fucking dope. But it landed at number seven. Number six, Watermelon Sugar. Which I think this song is what started all of this. Yeah, that was the first one I did. Um, Someone requested it. Did someone... I'm trying to think if someone requested it or was it on a playlist. I'm trying to think because I get both. I, I don't be remembering shit like that. Anyways, number six, Watermelon Sugar. Number five. Number five is Cherry. Yeah. I love that song. I love that song. All right. Now we at number four. And guys, if you want to know the reason for any of this, just go back and watch the playlist. Please, just go back and watch the playlist. I don't want to make this video super long. I just wanted to, to, to just wrap it up and rank these, these songs for y'all. So number four is Light Up. Light Up is dope, man. Light Up is so fucking dope. Light Up is so fucking dope, man. I, yo. All right. So before we get to my top three, let's do a quick recap. Quick, quick, quick recap. Number 12, Fine Line. 11, Sunflower, Volume 6. 10, Treat People With Kindness. 9, to be so lonely. Eight, Kenyan Moon. Seven, Golden. Six, Watermelon Sugar. Five, Cherry. Four, Light Up. Now, number three. <laughs> number three is She. She is just a dope, trippy ass song, man. She is dope. She, yo, I promise you, one night. I heard that song like three times, back to back to. I'm just like, yo, it's amazing song, ama ama amazing song. All right, let's move on. Number two, adore you, adore you. Actually, from the first time I heard this song, I'm like, this is one of my favorite songs. I, did I say that on the on the thing? I don't know, I was probably thinking it. I don't know. But 
Listening to the album over and over again, this song is a song that sticks out to me a lot. It just sticks out to me. It's just, I don't know. It, everything about this song is dope. Sonically, it's super dope. His vocals on this song. Um, yo, I love this song. I, I just love this song. And my favorite one. Oh, shit. I almost fucked up the camera with my little wheel drum. Steering wheel drum. <laughs> Hurry up, nigga. What's number one? Y'all already guessed it right now. It's Falling. I feel like Falling is the heart of this album. To me, Falling is the heart of this album. It's the heart. It's the heart of this album. I feel like it's the climax of the drama. It's just like... It's, it, 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 it's, it's, it's all the emotions put together and just like... Poof, this big explosion of beautiful madness and it's dope. I fucking love it. Love it. And, and there you go. There y'all go, man. Um, right now it's the perfect time to check your list. Did your list match mine? Did it match mine? I'm going to go over it one more time real quick. My favorite. Number one is Fallen. Number two is Adore You. Number three, She. Number four, Light Up. Number five, Cherry. Number six, Watermelon Sugar. Number seven, Golden. Number eight, Kenyan Moon. Number nine, To Be So Lonely. Number 10, Treat People With Kindness. Number 11, Sunflower, Volume 6. And number 12, Fine Line. Man, it's been beautiful. This album is fucking beautiful. And this album is, of course, going to live with me. When I like an album, I incorporate stuff into my playlist. I go back and I listen and I listen. And, yo, thank y'all for riding with me. It's been super dope. And if you stay to the end, you'll know that this Friday, that's when I will drop the first video. Right. That's when I'll drop the first video from the um um cover series. So I'm doing a whole Harry Styles cover series before I go into his first album. All right. And Friday, I'm dropping the first video or first two videos. It depends on on how I'm feeling and what I got going on. But I will definitely be dropping a video this Friday. And a lot of y'all won't know that because a lot of y'all won't make it to the end. So shit for y'all who do know. Shout out to you. For y'all who don't know, y'all gonna be like, oh, he disappeared on us again. But I'm letting you know right now, Friday. Yup, and that was it, man. That was it. And let me know what you think about this list down below. Did it match yours? Did you not like it? What could I have? Ah. <laughs> it's early as shit. I'm sorry, it's early as shit. But yeah, man, bless up, y'all. Bless up. Be safe out here. And if you're new here, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. We talk everything music, all different genres, all type of things. All type of things. All type of things, y'all know? Yeah, hit that subscribe button, notification bell. Like, share. It helps the channel. It really do. All right? See y'all Friday.